wondering, so there's still testing happening here. The, so doing the vaccination, you mean? Yes, sorry, yes, that's what I meant. Yes, are you, are you looking to get vaccinated? Or? Well, I wondered if you need to register prior to, to coming? Well, we can do an appointment for you right now if you need it. Do you need an appointment? Okay, so you, you can you can make an appointment, but you can do that, you can arrive here and then make an appointment? Yeah, we can do an appointment then... for you right here. Okay, and then are you are you doing the first shots? First or second for okay. Moderna. Okay, oh, I see, thank you for that. And then- uh... Are you filming? Yes. Oh, okay. I want to be filled. Okay. Are are you a public employee? I um, work for FEMA. Yeah. So that's yeah, pretty, yeah, that's but pretty I don't public. Want to be filled. Okay. Yeah. So you understand, as a public employee, you, you don't have an expectation of privacy when you're yeah, okay. carrying out your duties. Okay. Okay. Sorry, and I appreciate sorry. that. Maybe you don't want to okay. be filmed. But the fact is, so, the, the fact is that a lot of people hide behind that when, okay. they, when they just don't want their actions. But there are some places filmed. that they don't. I don't know if they allow. Are they allow filming here? Uh, they. I I think they're not, they're not. They're not. No. Okay. Maybe, maybe outside in camp, but not in the building. Okay, that sounds like a guess. No, uh, it's written right here on the, t on the, as you can see, Behind just on the door. door. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Somebody printed that out. Yep. Yeah, that's pretty invalid. That's paradigm. Okay, uh, now I understand. Okay, I mean, we just, Going by the rules, no, we're not. I, oh, I understand. Yeah, but but that's not an official sign. There's no there's no actual legal authority to prevent people from filming well, in this county building where they are lawfully allowed to go. I understand there are medical questions with protecting right. people's privacy uh -huh. and things yeah. like that, but yeah, you can't you can't that. just prohibit people from filming or taking pictures in inside of here. I don't know the rules. I don't know the law, but. That's what it says there, I'm sorry, I mean. Oh, well, I mean. So what exactly are you looking for? Uh, I, was, I was just asking those questions that, that you were able to answer. So. Yeah, we do have Moderna, you can do first or second shot, you don't need an appointment. Okay. Hello. Hi, hi. So do you, do you understand where this prohibition from uh, on filming and video comes from? Uh, I think it's from the county, but we can check for it. Could you? Sure. Where are you filming? Uh, why are you asking? Um, it's just unusual to stand in front of a door. Is it unusual? It's a, yes, it is. Okay, that's a that's a that's a solid opinion you have there. Where are you well, filming? You're going to ask me again. Well, you didn't answer. Yeah. Okay. Who are you? So I'm Chris Johnson, the medical director. The medical director yeah. of uh, Paradigm Site Services. Okay. Who are you? So, you could stop asking me that. What? Oh, because I'm not going to answer you. Okay. Is that is that a good answer? Is that enough of an answer to your question that it you're going to stop answer. asking me? Yeah. Thank you. Um, so, for you, I maybe have the question of why many uh, Paradigm employees who are working at the sites continue to tell people who are in public that they cannot film. All right, well, so I'm going to ask you to stop filming, but I'm going to find out for you. Okay. okay. I'm same as the name. I'm I'm not going to stop filming. Are you going to the vaccine? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. You, you can ask. You've been downtown too, right? Yeah. What's that? You've been downtown. Uh, I'm not going to answer that. Okay. All right. Okay. I, I don't know why do you need all this information about me? Right, so That's unusual. Okay, sir. Just come. Okay, sir means I should calm down. A little bit, yeah. More like journalism. Cool. It's not a full feature documentary, cool. I, though by the time this is over, I probably have enough material for a while. Cool, cool, cool. I'm going to step over here. To yeah, see yeah. Are you here for the vaccine, man? Yes. All right, uh, just so you know, this is the Moderna site. So we always do Moderna here. Just so you know, because a lot of people come looking for Pfizer. No, I think this is... Uh, Okay. Awesome. Uh -huh. yeah, cool. Thank you so much. I like your sunglasses. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I thought the same thing. I was going to say. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, it's not very bright in there. It really isn't, no. 
but I just like to keep my glasses on because just because I don't like like it's so bright out here and I'm looking outside just everything's yeah. good yeah, so. yeah. Uh, what gets me is you, you never know when a glare is going to come off of a windshield or something. <laughs> Anywhere. Yeah. It can be like half a mile yeah. away in that little point of light. Yeah. Okay, so uh, I forgot the guy's name. I'm just I'm just narrating now yeah, just yeah, so yeah, that we're yeah. not just standing here. Yeah. Um, he's gone to find out uh, the first question I asked him, which is where the prohibition on filming comes from and then I don't know if he's just too butthurt to answer the second question about why their employees I mean he's the first person I've talked to in Paradigm who's anywhere above a site uh, employee who's just administering the, the, the testing of the vaccine so I am really interested in, in, in what he has to say and Maybe more so. In, uh, <laughs> I think he's he's disappointed that I didn't just leave. That's what I picked up from that little <laughs> the, the FEMA man. He's disappointed. So oh, do you do you where do you, where do you get that information? It's illegal. For you to be filming, yes, it's against violations. Right? You're violating people's privacy. There's, there's clearly signs marked everywhere that there is no recording here. Yeah, there's one there that yes. someone printed up. Yeah. So I could print up a T-shirt that says no recording and that doesn't, that doesn't have any legal weight. That's that's the issue. With this you're on county property, sir, and there are people here for medical purposes, so you're violating yeah. their privacy. That's um, okay. So that it's I'm on county property, which is public property and public access right now. Standing in the doorway. You're, you're allowed to be here. Uh, you are not oh, okay, now I'm standing in the doorway. Are you not? I am because I'm talking to you. I'm sorry, I'm blocking access. You got me there. How about the real issues? Why do you think that people have a right not to be filmed in public and that it's a violation of their privacy? Where do you get that idea? I'm not going to argue with you, sir. Well, that's good because... It's clearly posted, so... Yeah, it's clearly posted on a printout on Paradigm Laboratory's letterhead, which makes it yes, so authoritative. Uh, and we are treating people here, so... Yep. So you need to uh, you need to pay attention to HIPAA Hi, sir. regulations. Are you here for your vaccine? You can come right this way, please. Thank you. You're Sorry, welcome. I nearly stopped that guy from getting in. That was close. Yes. Okay. It's okay. Thank you. So, so you do, you do, you are aware of HIPAA regulations involving protected health information, and you keep that confidential as a, a provider of a medical service who's no, required by law to we do just, so. We disclose all information to every patient. I am not going to allow you to have patient access. That's good. Not... Excellent. I don't want it. Good. Right. I also don't want to give up other rights in the process. Okay. Appreciate it. Thank you. So. Here we stand. Yeah, here we do stand. So if it was if it was illegal for me to be filming, what 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 law would I be breaking, and how would that be? Oh, hello, sir. Can I get your name again? No. No. So he's filming. I cannot let you interfere with any patient or patient right. entrance. So if you block anyone. You are violating yep. your right to yep. So here we go. Here's the here's the gotcha. If anyone has to like pause for a millisecond while they go in the door, I'm then violating something else. Well, you're just gotcha. violating their privacy. That's all right. I mean, you told me your name once. I just thought it would be nice to actually remember it because I forgot it. But uh, you are a private contractor with the county, correct? Oh, okay. I I get what I get. You are clever. Aren't you? Very clever. Until you get seen. Until you get caught. And then maybe you're more what? What happens when you get caught?
Yeah, what happens then? Right this way. Hi. Sorry, you guys can step right in. Thank you. Who's they? Can I ask? Absolutely, you can. I can? Absolutely. Yeah, who's coming? I'll give you three guesses. Don't care enough to guess, actually. You care enough to be here. Unless it was ninjas, then I'd just leave. Did you call ninjas? Mm, you're so funny. Thank you for wasting our time, sir. <laughs> I don't think you need help with that. <laughs> so this must have come up like multiple times. The process has been going on for a while. So people have maybe wanted to document the process. But this is this is still our. You can just step this way, please. This is still our off the cuff process. Oh yeah, no worries. Oh, you know what? He doesn't need it for the baby. No, that's okay. I'll just wait. Okay. If you film them. Um... Oh, then there's a kid. Yeah. Yeah. You need to be respectful of people. Oh, and, and so you're assuming that I'm not respectful. Um, you are definitely not Absolutely. being respectful. You've been asked to leave several times, so yeah. and to not record, clearly. Right. So you I should just leave. have respect for people oh. over law, over Obviously, rights. Obviously you have some challenges. Over freedom. I should respect people. That's exactly how tyranny gets ensconced. Exactly Respecting how. Respecting people. That's how tyranny gets ensconced. Respecting people. Over law, over rights, and over freedom. Exactly. Probably nearly every time. That'd be real nice. What would be? For you to be respectful would be real nice. There's apparently challenges. So. I don't know. I want you to live in a free society. Thank you. Because I respect you. Hi. Right this way. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. without it sounding like chipmunks, because this is boring. I seriously could care less. Huh? You don't need to tell me what you're doing. <laughs> that's, that's not the first response I got. Mm. Who are you? Why are you filming? I don't think I asked you that. I think no, I you didn't. shut it off, because I could care less why you're filming. I care that you are filming. I don't care why you are filming. Right? Even if it's for a lawful, even civic-minded reason, you or don't simple care. simple-minded. Yeah, there we go. Let's devolve. I could learn to be more respectful. I definitely could. So. I wouldn't want you to hurt yourself. Hmm. Highly not recommended thing to say. Hello. Hey. He's, uh, he's no, no, no. He's already in here. But when, no. he, even when he said, "Can you know I shot?" Him, he said, "Yeah." Well, it took me six months to get in here, oh. and he almost left when you started giving him a list of what kind you had. I just want to look at how he's doing. I can totally see that outfit on the bridge of a spaceship. Does it have a little symbol? A little chevron? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. 
I think he'd be in the role of the bad guy, unfortunately. So now I know it can't be ninjas because they would have been here by now. Thanks, sir. And if they. Yeah, let me grab him, sure. Just, did you say felony? Yes. <laughs> wow. The clock is ticking, though. <clears throat> Step to the side, there's patients coming through. I think they can get to the door. Mm. I think there's more than enough. Thank space you. Here. Go ahead, there. Hi. I think you're actually closer right to the, their walkway than I am. Yeah, I'm allowed to be here. Trust me, you don't want to go toe to toe with me, sir. You definitely. Okay. Is that, that sounds like a That is like a definitely not a threat. I'm asking you to step back. Okay. I'm not stepping anywhere in the way. Okay, so right here we've got, let me see if the camera can capture this at all. We've got about mm, two feet space to my right. And, and I have about, patients left, coming through right here. Patients coming through this remaining mm, seven feet Look or so. Look how good you are at math. Yeah, well, I mean, it's not math, it's estimation. Yeah. So, Diana? Yes, sir. I'm just pointing that camera in where people are giving information that it's on to you. On yes. I would rather him step away from patients, so. Yeah, it's okay. He'll he need to. The only reason I'm standing in the shade, and I can still get shade too. So. And actually, the only reason I moved over to there was because I just wanted to capture more of this guy. And we're blocking him. Yeah, that happens. Sir, do you have any weapons on you? Do you? Do you have any weapons? Thank you. Have a do you? Day. I do not. No. Do you have any weapons? I choose not to answer that. Okay. Interesting. Are you breaking any other laws in other areas of your life? Are you breaking any other laws in other areas of your life? What are those laws that you're breaking? Have you stopped beating your girlfriend? Oh, what is it? Uh, Johnny Five-O, come to my rescue. What's that phrase you use? I'll, 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 I'll clip it in. exercising your rights to film and stuff like that? Well, not just that. I'm also enjoying a sunny day. Mm. Okay. But, yeah, that's my main motivation, right there. Uh, exercising them and 
exploring the boundaries of where they're they're being curtailed. I mean, but you do understand the, the privacy that people, you know, like their information and stuff. Like, you do understand that, right? Absolutely. I do understand that. Okay. I seem to understand that better than officials of Paradigm Health Laboratories, or whatever it's called. Paradigm Laboratories? Getting any status updates on when whatever happens next happens? I'm so glad you're here. Stressful, like there's a dude like standing there. So stressful. <laughs> I don't know. I feel stressed. I mean, we're having we're having contention. Hello. I don't dig that all that much in general. I'd rather be friends with people. I really would. You know, it's better for everything about my life to be friendly, including my health. So now more than ever, it's important to have friends and to be respectful. So do you think people here that are coming here appreciate you for that? Probably a lot of them don't because they don't understand the law and, and the rights that have been established very clearly long ago and continuing to this day. You can walk around in public with a camera and film anything you can see, period. Right. That's it. You have the right to, to access the press as a journalist, cover a story, publish the material, period. Especially from a public place. And as a, as a private contractor to a county agency, when you make a record while in the course of your duties, that is a public record that can then be requested under the Freedom of Information Act, along with uh, kind of tangent information, including uh, answering the question of whether you emailed that record to anyone by uh, you know, also revealing your emails. Yeah, but when you're talking about being respectful, Yes, I am. So the question was, do you think people appreciate it? Whether people appreciate I, I feel like I answered the question because people don't appreciate it, and I think that's because they don't understand their rights and the law. Well, we're not being forced. And it, I, see, I think I see where you're going. If there's, if there's a question of people of, of offending or bothering people that isn't covered by law, there's tons of that stuff. I'm not just here to film people because because whatever, you know, if people are if people are offended by something I'm doing and I have no compelling reason to continue to do it, I will stop. I what have a compelling reason, reason. What is your compelling reason? Uh, we've talked really quite close around the core of it already. Just tell me in plain English what is the purpose I of your I don't know how to make my English more plain. I have, as as a, a member of the public, I have a right to film what I can see from the public place. There's the right, right, but what is the reason? So, the re you are the reason. Right inside here. Okay. Thank you. Really you are the reason. You come out and say stop. I I actually ask you why you film. That's you that's answer. fine. You may be curious, and you can totally ask someone, and they are under no obligation to tell you. No, you're not. But it seems important to you. I just wanted to know what your reason was. It's amazing how consistent they are. We'll give them that. Hey, they're consistent. Just like you'd say about the serial killer. Oh, well, at least he was methodical. Okay, it's also pretty much equally important to me to not answer that if I don't choose really, to. I don't think you really have a reason. Okay, so here we're gonna cut at my, my motivations, my sense of purpose in life. I'm wasting my time. 
I should go back to my basement and email this to my five friends. Little desk here at this No, I just don't think they've formulated a reason, actually. Oh, because, yeah, I haven't thought that far ahead. I don't think they have. I'm not very methodical. I understand that. Some people are very methodical. It's helpful for certain things. sensitive microphone yeah better than the one on the phone for sure it's picking up this these people as they're giving their information I have no idea we'll find out how them putting tar on the roof and the wind blowing it right over the no smoking sign on on that first sign that tells you how to get in here and uh, you know and the air is just filled with tar I'm a former smoker I know that tar is one of the worst components of tobacco smoke and so it's just funny to be breathing that in but whatever you got to do what you got to do to keep the roof sealed some cool content, go to the back, there's a wash pipe in one of the doors. Where is it? Right there, over there on the, the oh, yeah. garage doors, the highs. There's a little one here, too. I had, that looks like the kind that uh, got into my house and I left them. They made, uh, they made their nests on the little lights, like the fairy lights, like Christmas tree lights. Yeah. And they would put the nest around the light, and, that, and so they were getting the warmth. Like just a little bit of warmth from that light at night. Hi, sir. Hello. Actually, yep. Yep. In the right spot. Thank you. I actually still have the, the, the lights with the nest on. I actually I do I do nature photography as well. Um, so I might I might go for that. But what we're gonna run into here is that we have eight minutes now uh, until I run out of space. So. Uh, if they don't get here soon, there will be a chapter two, I guess. Uh, if they get here soon, it'll be brief. So I don't know if you have any way of getting a follow-up or a, a, what do you call a, a status update or anything. But if they're, if they're not here soon, then whatever conversation I have with them will take place somewhere else. Because I've, I've already been three places today, and I thought I was just going to come by here and zip, zip in, zip out. 
we're waited. In fact, because I might have an interaction with them when I leave, I have, I'm going to leave the rest of the space for that. So I'm going to walk out if they want to know where I am. I'm going to be heading toward the number two bus line to go back downtown to Ronstadt Center. So thank you for your time, and uh, I'll probably see you again. What up?